do I find this experience? It's definitely work, but it's great because you get good results. Yeah, that's what I like about this experience. You go through all the tears, and in the end you come out smiling. Happy tears. <laughs> so I found it really good. I really, it's, it's a tough love. <laughs> Returning to Slim Marius, because the last time I was here, I lost a significant amount of weight. I lost um, over five kilos. And for someone who's, well, everybody was like, you're already slim. There's no way you can lose that amount. And it just was a pleasant surprise to see that if I worked really hard and, you know, just be in that right environment with the right group of people, I can do anything. Because you feed off everybody's energy. And that's pretty much why I keep coming back, because the people and the same sort of mindset and it's just it's a good environment not just the food not just the activities but just the surroundings it's peace of mind every single group that i've had so far has just been really good it's marvelous because everybody just wants to do really well and i think being in that in that mindset and everybody being in that mindset keeps you you know motivated and there's always someone in the group that's super motivation so you feed off the energy and so I think the groups are always always good yeah oh gosh there's so many highlights to my stay but the the highlights to my stay are the place the location I love um, the people I love I love Galia and I just love the place and it's yeah did I say that already yeah I love the place because it's just such a great place it's peaceful um, I live in the city so it's away from that busy lifestyle and it's just such a beautiful scenery. That's what I love about the place. The requirements of the modelling industry are definitely very narrow. Um, you do have to be a certain body shape, you do have to be a certain mind and you have to be tough. You know that from the beginning and you learn that more when you're in the industry. But what I have learned about keeping myself healthy is don't starve yourself. That's not good and being here it taught me that you can eat vegetables and eat raw foods and still lose weight and as a young girl you think that you do anything and I remember going you know to meetings thinking oh gosh I can't eat today I can't eat today because you know I've got this photo shoot but that's not the way forward because you can make yourself sick and you have to be energetic and I think being a slim area it teaches you that you can work really hard in the activities you do and keep on with your lifestyle but still eat really healthy and still lose weight and being in the modeling industry you have to have energy you have to be slim but you've got to have energy it's a high demand for you know these slim girls and being slim is high demand but it's more demand to be healthy yeah so they like a bubbly model and if you're hungry I, I'm miserable when I'm hungry I'm very grumpy so yeah, I think definitely my job having the health pressures um, has taught me how to be healthy around that scenario. And being at Slim Mary has taught me to, to eat well. Definitely to eat well and that you can eat well and lose weight. You don't realise how much energy you've got and, and until you get into the classes. Because you're, you're sort of like, oh no, I can't possibly have much energy. I'm sort of having, you know, very healthy vegetables all day. I can't possibly, because you're used to having, you know, oats and lots of chicken and fried foods. <laughs> so you, you don't expect to be very energetic with um, just on vegetables and fruit. And it's a pleasant surprise because the fitness is incredible. We, um, we have uh, the dance class. That's my favourite, I love the dancing, particularly the dancing and the circuits, there's so many different different uh, dynamics of fitness and I love that about Slimeria because that's, that's pretty much the most important thing for me, I love my fitness and for someone like me it made it that much more fun, yeah, love the fitness. For someone who's not a walker to ask how are the walks, um, it's been something that I definitely now enjoy. And just taking a brisk walk sometimes is so refreshing. It's so surprisingly refreshing and that's what I love about the walk. I, I shocked myself, honestly, I was like, walks, really? Can't we do a run? Can't we do a jog or something else? Because I'm a proper fitness fanatic. So 
to, to learn how to enjoy and take walks was such a wonderful thing. Yeah, I enjoy the walks. They're lovely and you take us to beautiful places. It's not just the exercise we're getting, but it's seeing the place we're at. Because sometimes you don't have time in your busy schedule to stop and look around you. But that's what I love about the walks. <laughs> the accommodation here at Slumeria is really beautiful. I, I like my room. It's a very old-fashioned room. I like the way it feels and it's very like homely and I think accommodation is very important and it's all different types of rooms. They all have a different feel so I like that. In my room I, it's cosy, you know, I'm right at the top and it's very cosy. I like, I like just the old-fashioned setting of it. It just feels very um, kind of, what's the word, intimate. Yeah, and I'm a very lazy person so I spend a lot of my time in bed <laughs> because I like sleeping a lot. Um, I love my bed and I think yeah, the comfort is important. Your accommodation is very good. Mm. I personally like the food. I, mean, I don't know about everybody else but for me they're edible and most of the time vegetables for me aren't edible so um, the food's great. I've had the relaxation massage. I got to do the muscle soak bath. I've gotten to do um, another massage called the honey. What's the what's it called? Um, it's a basically battery, I call it. But um, so I've had those three massages, and I have to say they were nice. It's nice to take a bath after a long day, and your spa facility is enough. You know, sometimes you need that after a long day, and it's good that you you have that aspect in in the detox because your body needs inner and outer relaxation. It's, it's good, it's very good that we can have that facility. Relaxation here is really lovely because you've got the fantastic white room which is set up mainly for relaxation and you've got the beautiful music that you play in there. So basically, in, in short, relaxation is 100%. More than anything outside of the activities and the fitness, it's you time. If you've never taken time out of your life to just do you and relax, this is the place to be because you get that and much more. Detox is tough. If I were to say it was easy then, then I would be lying. I just, it's the symptoms that you get from detoxifying, but you power through it and that's, that's the wonders of Samaria because you, you're able to push beyond your means and you're able to surprise yourself in many ways. Even the days when you feel very low and that's really the downside to it, but otherwise you pass through it. Yay! <laughs> I'm always happy with the results because that's one thing I know I get out of this. Through all the trials and tribulations, the pain in the rain, <laughs> I always get good results in. So I, I get very excited when you talk about results. I, yeah, I know that and I, I always, yeah, in simple terms, we deliver here. We deliver here. If I was a part of the group, I'd definitely put that as my slogan. The educational aspects of here is really good because we get the nutritional talk and it, it teaches you a lot about the, and just looking at your dinner, you realise the things that you've been missing and the things that you definitely should add to your diet that you wouldn't, like the cabbage philosophy that you have here how much work cabbage does for you on the inside and beetroots and all that good stuff. I mean, it's definitely good and having gone, prepared my meals outside of it, I definitely have more understanding of what's good for the body rather than what's convenient for the time. And I think it teaches you that you, you eat to live <laughs> instead of live to eat. So that's definitely a wonderful lesson that I take away from